Winter is the prime season in Washington for steelhead fishing. It is very challenging, and until you get the hang of it, you might want to consider going with a licensed guide. We did that on this trip, and we're glad we did. Well, I think uh, the magic in steelhead fishing is is the steelhead itself. It's probably it's probably the top sports fish caught on light enough tackle to let it fish like it should in the world. It uh, it's a beautiful fish. Uh, it runs fast. It jumps. It's hard to land. You catch them in beautiful water like this. Uh, the whole setting is a very nice outdoor experience. You know, there are a number of techniques that, that catch steelhead successfully and well. Drift and bait, like we are going to do here today, uh, is the most effective way. And the reason it's the most effective way is because you're presenting a bait that they'd like to bite in a manner that's that's natural to them. You're floating, you've got a pencil weight on and a, and a leader about three feet long and a bait on there and you're floating the boat and floating the throwing the line out and floating the boat along with your sinker and it's drifting in a natural way when a fish sees that he'll bite it. Another great advantage to drifting bait is that you cover a lot of water. If you're going to spend your money and hire a guide, you want a quality, safe, and successful experience. You, you need a guide who, who can keep you safe in an emergency, so you need a guide who has first aid and a CPR card current. You need a guide who has liability insurance, you don't want to think about that, but that's a fact. You need liability insurance. You want an honest, reputable guide. The best way to find out if a guide's honest and reputable is cause, call the state and ask if they have a business license. Well, I think if you go to the Department of Fish and Wildlife Commercial Licensing Department and ask them how long a guide has had a license, you might find that your potential guide doesn't even have a license. There's lots of them in the state who, who are not operating like they should. To catch steelhead or catch any fish successfully, you're, all, you're only as good as your equipment. You can't cut quarters on it. Um, you need the best rods, the best reels, the best line, the best hooks that, that you can buy. Look for the deep water. Fish the deep water. Fish where it drops off the shallow into the deep, all the way down through the deep water, and up into the tail out a little bit. That's, that's where the most fish are going to be laying most of the time. 